Good morning, students. Welcome to the next session of your computer classes. We are going to start with chapter number seven, changing background and style. Here we are going to talk about the program Scratch. That is a programming language which gives a knowledge of programming to the students. We have done some topics in the previous chapter also where we learned how we can uh, work with the multiple sprites, what are the graphic effects that we can make available to the sprite, how we can give or how we can add sound to the sprites these we these topics have been covered in the previous chapter today we are going to start with chapter number seven that is changing backgrounds and styles now as you can see in both the pictures the first picture has a beautiful background whereas the second picture is blank the background in a picture helps the viewer in making the story of the picture a blank picture without any background depicts nothing now as you can see this balloon hot air balloon which is being flying the background is given of a sky so we can assume we can connect it that the balloon is or the hot air balloon is flying in the sky but with this bit we can't connect it with the same assumption because the background is white we can't connect it that the balloon is flying or it's stable or it's standing okay so a background helps the viewer in making the story of the picture whereas a blank picture or without any background fails to depict anything if background is clear and attractive it adds to the beauty of the picture on the other hand if the background is blurred or not clear the viewer may not like the picture similarly in scratch there are many inbuilt background that you can add in a project just like sprites background can be uploaded from scratch library or, or can also be painted the background is added on the stage where the sprite performs action how we can do this there are three buttons which are used to add background on the stage you can add a background from the scratch library you can paint a new background or you can click a picture to add it as a background let us see how these three button works so import to add background from the scratch library follow the steps click on the stage icon given below the sprite list stage library here upload a backdrop surprise paint it and choose a backdrop so if I click on choose a backdrop so you can see different backdrops let's say I am taking the theater backdrop so you can see the background has been changed with the theater background 
Okay? So click on the stage icon given below the strip. The costume tab will change into the background tab. Click on the background tabs. Click on the import button. Import background uh, back dialog background dialog box appears. Double click on any folder. Select any one of the option from the folder and click on OK. The selected option add itself on the stage under the background tab. As you can see, we clicked here. From here we choose. Now we will have a sports also. So let's say this time I'm taking a, a football ground, soccer player. So as you can see, the soccer background has been assigned. Paint. To paint a new background, follow the steps. Click on the paint button given under the background tab. The paint editor window appears. The left pane has the tools and the color palette that you can use to paint the a paint and the right pane is the pane on which the painted background appears. Using the tools and the other color palette, paint a background as shown and click on OK. The painted background appears on the stage and under the background tabs. Clicked on paint. Let's say I am taking some shapes. One, two and three. Then I will color something. So as you can see, what am I drawing? is being applied as a background in the stage okay we can draw the lines something like this we can erase it we can color it out also like color if i want to change it change the color now dish dish and dish dish so all these can be done i can paint a new backdrop i can import a new backdrop even i can click a picture by using the camera to put it as a backdrop to click a picture and add it as a background on the stage follow the step click on the camera button under the background tab We can upload it from the file also. Uh, I think I don't have, yeah, here is a camera button here. If I click it on, it will ask me permission to, to take the backdrop. 